back from Daddy. What are we going to do? So, so. <laughs> so, we're going to go do two things right now, right? Mm -hmm. What What are they? Have to find his book. And? Water fountain. So, welcome to the Axel Daddy. So, so. No, half price book to Water Fountain Show. No, not that. <laughs> not that. Water Fountain half price book show. I like that one. That's a good one. Come on, let's go show the kids. Kids, we are here at Half Price Books. It's a used bookstore. Books are so cool and they're so much fun. Here, wait. Okay, so let's we're about go. to go out and see a fountain that's by the bookstore, though. It's really cool. Come on, Come with on. us. But before we cross, look. See these cars right here? They're our protection, right? Look, one more. Oh my goodness, but look, when we go outside of the cars, are we protected anymore? Yeah. No. Cars can hit us from the left I and look. hit us from the right. I look, I okay, look, so look, that car right there, if it ran into us, then that would hurt very badly, right? Be very dangerous. So, when we're, when we're going out, let's go back in real quick. Back in, like Finding Nemo, remember? They go in and they go out. So, when we go out from the cars, from the protection, we look to the left, right? And we look to the right, right? No cars? Okay, it's safe to cross. Come on, kids. Always be safe when you're in parking lots, kids. And always stay with your parents. What? Oh, a Ford Mustang. Oh, yeah. That's an awesome looking car right there. Okay, now, look to the right. Look at that yellow car. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Let's go look at it. But look to the right. Look to the left. No cars? All right, safe to cross. Look, look at that car. That is a... It's a Corvette! Dude! That thing is so cool! And look at the lawnmower! Look, he's mowing that grass! What? That's so cool! <laughs> We're gonna go to the fountain, kids, okay? Dude, is that cool? Look at that! What? Dude! Alright, put your hand in. <laughs> put your whole hand on it! <laughs> okay, you ready? Ooh. Ooh. Ah, I gotcha. <laughs> oh, well, you know what? We don't want to put stuff in here. We don't want to put stuff in the pond because it makes it dirty, right? And we want to keep it clean. Look how clean that water is. You want to race around the fountain? Yeah. All right, ready? Okay, we're going to race around one time. So who are you? Who are you? Oh, there's a cricket. Oh, wow. All right, are you ready to race? Yeah. What kind of car are you? Uh, speedy. You're Speedy? Yeah. Speedy Mouse? And what kind of car are you? Are you uh, driving? Uh, that yellow kind of car. Oh, you're driving a Corvette? Okay. Yeah. And I'm Wiz, and I'm driving a blue Mustang, okay? All right, kids, are you ready to race? Oh, ready. what are the kids going to ride? Uh. Oh, uh, look, there's a BMW over there. How about they drive the BMW? The BMW? It's over there, look. The red car over there. All right. Yeah. All right, kids, you're going to ride the BMW. Are you ready to race? Ready. Let's go. Go. Yeah. go. <laughs> look, the kids are passing us up. They're passing us up. Oh, they're out of behind. Oh, they're passing us up. You yeah, all kids are going to win. The kids won. <laughs> You won, kids! <laughs> Way to race! <laughs> what? Oh, look at that! <laughs> That's so cool! Man, these, these just, kids, these just of water right here are being pumped out by a big pump! A huge pump inside of there! And it's shooting the water through the pipes out here. And then it sucks it back in and circulates. It keeps going and going. Isn't that cool? Look, there's a pipe right there. It runs all the way around. Uh, that pipe I'm... feeds all of these no, no, uh, no. fountains. No, no. The big pump is where we're standing. Uh, yeah, it might no. be. The but... big pump is where we're Yeah, or it might be in there. We don't know. All right, kids, we're going to go to the bookstore. Come on with us. All right, we're here in the bookstore, kids. We're gonna go inside and see if we can find some awesome books. Look, look at those kitties. Ah, <laughs> those are silly looking guys. That one is. Uh huh. That's that's for Halloween stuff, I think. All right. 
There it is. Oh, that's where the stuffed animals are. Look at that. There's that same rattlesnake that Graham Graham got to. Same one. <laughs> you know, kids, you might remember this rattlesnake from the, from what? From the monster truck video? Yeah. The monster truck arena Look. one? And was he in the Look. pit trying to bite the Look. cars? There's two of their friends. <laughs> They're good rattlesnake friends. Oh, Hi, rattlesnake. Friend. Dude, what? There's it's like, it's like a whole family of rattlesnakes. Look. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's a, a bear and a squirrel. But wait a minute. The squirrel's almost as big as the bear. Is that right? Ah. Hey, don't eat me, Mr. Bear. I'm just eating the acorn. Look, he's eating the acorn. Isn't that cute? No, look. <laughs> look. What? A turtle. Dude, that turtle's awesome. I want to eat him. Oh, no, we're not going to get the turtle, silly. <laughs> but are we ever going to get that same turtle? Um, you know what? Hey, you know what? You can get him if you like. Well, because he cost $5.99, and you have $5 from Grandma. But I don't have it. I don't have my $5 It's in my wallet. With me. But I have it. It's in my wallet. Do you want to get that? Or would you rather get that than a race car? A race car? Uh, I mean, uh, uh, some cars. Yeah. You'd rather get this guy? Okay. Uh, and you get... Axel's Grandma gave him $5 no, to spend on whatever what he wanted. Hi, Mr. Lemur. My name's Koali the Koala. Can I have a hug? My name's Lemmy the Lemmy. Hey, Lemmy. Big hug. Mm. I eat eucalyptus leaves for dinner and lunch and breakfast. What do you eat, Mr. Lemur? I know what lemurs eat. They eat fruit. I eat fruit for breakfast. Oh, wow. I climb trees a lot. Do you climb trees? Yeah. Awesome. We both like trees, and we both like stuff that comes from trees. That's so cool. <laughs> Oh, wow. I like eucalyptus leaves. That's it. <laughs> well, I'm going to go sit back in my eucalyptus tree, okay? <laughs> I right. like eucalyptus leaves, too. What? <laughs> okay. All right. Hey, let's go find some books. Come on. Let's see. Mom found a book. Oh, look at that. A house, a house in, in the, the woods. woods. Look, at, look, look. But look at this. What's on there? Is that an otter or a beaver right there? That's a moose. That's a moose. That's a... It looks like a beaver, because he's got those two front and teeth the, and a long tail. And these are... Oh, Little baby think, beavers. Yeah. Yeah. This looks like a really cool book. <coughs> hey, Mr. Otter. <coughs> Hi. <laughs> Kids, books are so much fun to read, and they're so interesting, too. I love the pictures. Do you like pictures in books? Uh -huh. You do? And even if they don't have pictures, sometimes you can just use your imagination when you're reading the words. This is really uncomfortable. There's an otter on me. <laughs> he loves you so much. Oh, okay. I'll give him a big hug. <laughs> and you a big hug, too. Okay, let's check out the books that Mommy got for us. You sit down on that chair. I'll sit down on this chair. Uh, here. Can you read the books, this Mr. Otter? Yes, I love reading books to people. Mr. Otter, are you ready to read? He's, he's going to read, okay? A House in the Woods. Inga Moore. Turn the page. Oh, wow, look at that. Look, there's a pig right there. See that, kids? There's a um, pig. Oh, there's another pig in a teepee made of sticks. That's so cool. Is that forest beautiful? That reminds me of Oregon. Maybe that's the mommy pig or the daddy pig. Yes, look, there's even some mushrooms down there. Toadstools. I think that's the mommy pig because it looks like the daddy pig's gone. Oh, okay. Or maybe that's the daddy maybe, pig. Maybe, yeah. A little pig had made a den for himself in the woods. Next door, another little pig had made himself a hut. Wow, look. Oh, there's a den right there. See that? That's a den. A little pig had made himself a den. And look, this pig had made himself a hut. I called it a teepee, but we'll call it a hut because that's what they call it here. One morning, the two little pigs went out walking together. One little pig found a feather, and the other found an interesting stick. Wow, Mr. Otter, that's good reading skills. See, this little pig found an interesting stick. See how it has those zigzags? And this little pig found a feather. Huh. That's cool. But that bird must have died or something. I must have killed it or it died by itself. 
Oh, well, you, you know what? Like, just because a feather's on the ground doesn't mean a bird died. It, it could mean that the feather just fell out. That That's the most likely uh, thing to have happened. Look. Okay. Oh, look at that. All right, Mr. Otter, can you read the rest? Sure. But when the first little pig brought her feather home to her den, she discovered Bear had moved in, which she didn't mind because she liked Bear. Uh, only Bear was so big. Oh, dear. The den was wrecked. Uh-oh, the den was wrecked. Look, Bear is so big that he wrecked Little Pig's den. Man. And so a leaf den. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, look at that. <laughs> Moose. Yeah. And when the second little pig went home to his hut with his slit stick, he discovered Moose had moved in, which he didn't mind either. Because he liked Moose. Aww, the pig liked the moose. Only Moose was even bigger than Bear. And when he stood up <clears throat> politely to say good morning, crash! The hut was so also wrecked. Wow, look at that. The moose tried to get inside of the hut. See there? But then it wrecked the hut. Is that a silly moose? Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Why did he think that he would fit inside of that hut? Maybe we'll just pointing it out. Mm-hmm. Oh, look, they're all sitting on a bench. <laughs> Which left the two little pigs with nowhere to live, not to mention moose and bear, and this was a pickle. It really was. Maybe they could... Those two pigs could turn them into a pickle. <laughs> they could eat the pickle. <laughs> that was so silly. Like a moose bear pickle. Kids, that's funny. Do you, like a moose and bear do, pickle. Do you know what... When you're in a pickle, do you know what that means? What? Guess what that means? What? When you're in a pickle, that means what? that you're in a in a situation that's difficult to figure out. It's difficult to figure out. You're in a difficult situation when you're in a pickle. Then Moose had a brilliant idea. Oh, then Moose had a brilliant idea, Mr. Otter wants to read. Why not build a big house where they could all live together? Oh! <gasps> That's a great idea, yeah! See? Look, Moose. There's Moose and his big idea. Mm-hmm. A great big house where they can all live together. Mm-hmm. Well, it was an exciting plan, except that building a big house with real windows and doors, a roof, stairs, a chimney, stacks, isn't easy. They couldn't do it on their own. So Moose called the beavers on the telephone. <gasps> He called the beavers. Beavers are good at cutting down wood, right? And building things like dams. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But do beavers build houses? No. No. But they're not <laughs> they build their build own houses. House. <laughs> Look at all those beavers. They're all pulling up with their trucks of lumber. Look at that. That's <laughs> like a mighty machine. Son. Yeah. And soon afterwards, a team of beaver builders came to help them with their work. The beavers said, if it was all right, they wished to be paid in peanut butter sandwiches, to which no one had any objection. What? Peanut butter sandwiches? <laughs> they want to be paid? Is that what all the sandwiches were at the beginning of the book? I think so. By lunchtime, the walls of the house were up. By lunchtime? What? Lunchtime? Is that silly? Then they both went with the two little pigs to the junkyard for furniture and curtains and all those things that go uh, inside a house. The moose is... Did they... They went to the junkyard to get all their furniture? The junkyard? The junkyard. Is that silly? That's what they made on yeah. a, a junkyard tail. Yeah, and look, there's a badger. Ah, it's not a honey badger, though. At last, the house was finished. The beavers handed over their bill and left. But there was just enough time to get to the store. Look at that. See that? <laughs> Dude, look at that house. That's a pretty cool house. I want to live in that house. To buy the bread and peanut butter. <laughs> Dude, look at all that bread and peanut butter they're buying. Wow. Oh my goodness. So why are they buying bread and peanut butter? Because they want peanut butter sandwiches. Yeah, they gotta pay the beavers. Or peanut butter and jelly. The beavers, they finished the project. So or they're like, peanut pay butter up. and jelly. 
Then the little pigs helped Moose and Bear make six plates of peanut butter sandwiches, which they delivered in person to the beavers, who all had all gone back to their lodge on the lake. Look, it's a lodge on the lake. That, that's what the beavers live in. They need to go to sleep uh -huh. now. And they're going to sleep. <gasps> Look, it says, sweet dreams, everyone. <laughs> that was a cool book. Do you want to get that book? Yeah. You do? Okay. Look, I decided to get this one because they all are costume watch. Yeah, and you only had a certain amount of money that Grandma gave you to buy something with. Yeah, isn't I think it's cool that you decided to buy that turtle because I, I really I like had... the turtle's color. Yeah, me too. Mm-hmm. And we're gonna get a book too. All right. So, are books fun to read, Bubba? Mm -hmm. Yes, they are. All right, kids. Will you guys get out and go to a used bookstore with your parents sometime? Ask them if they'll go. They're really fun to go to. The books are a lot cheaper, and 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 you end up finding some really cool stuff that you may not even be able to like, find at a regular bookstore. Lucky like and Hank Toto. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. All right, well, kids, get out. Have your own adventure. Bye, kids. Bye. See you later.